Hey guys, welcome to my channel and thank you so much for stopping by. So today's video is a requested video from one of my subscribers and a very good person, Priyanka. So in today's video, I'm going to share with you my all-time favorite top 10 red lipsticks. I think the trend of red lipsticks can never go out of fashion and a red lipstick can glam up any look instantly and you should have a red lipstick in your makeup kit. And these are the lipsticks that I absolutely love and I've tried to include um, lipsticks from different price range uh, for your convenience and they are available worldwide. You can get it easily online and offline as well. And I will be giving you uh, hand swatches and lip swatches. Also, I will explain uh, the formula of all these lipsticks. And there are two bullet lipsticks, rest of them are liquid lipsticks and most of them are matte because I am a sucker for matte lipsticks. So yeah, without further ado, let's get started. But before starting, please take a moment to subscribe and also press the bell icon next to it so that you do not miss out on any of my videos. So yeah, without further ado, let's get started. Let me tell you, first I'm going to mention one lipstick that is not a part of this top 10 just because this is an Indian drugstore lipstick and it is not available outside India and I wanted to mention this lipstick because I think these lipsticks are so underrated. I have hardly seen anyone talking about these lipsticks but the quality of these lipsticks is so so good. I love them. I have tried two of them and I absolutely love them and they are so affordable. And I'm talking about this color of London lipstick and this is in the shade Madness. This is a red but it is not a true red. It has a hint of pink in it. If you love red lipsticks but if you are a bit afraid of like applying that bold red lipstick then you can give it a shot. I think this is a perfect red for you. And this is such a color it suits every uh, skin tone and I have tried two of them. One is in the shade cherry eyes that was a spot on red and it was a spot on due for mac review if you have mac review then grab that shade cherry eyes and see for yourself what i'm talking about i do not have that lipstick anymore with me and i used to love that shade and that was the first shade that i bought from this range if you are from India, I will highly, highly suggest you to get these lipsticks. These are so good and it is for like 180 rupees. And one more thing, I was checking it on Nika's website. I do not know why. Each shade has a different price tag. Like one shade is for 225, one is for 190, one is for like 250. I do not know why, but I'm pretty much sure I got it from a local store and it was for like 180 rupees. The staying power of this lipstick is so good. It lasts on me for like 8 hours. It does transfer because it is a semi matte finish but after like uh, 2 hours it settles down to be a complete matte lipstick. And this is so comfortable to wear. So yeah, you know what, you are not breaking your bank if you are from India. You should give li this lipstick a shot. I'm sure you're gonna love this one. This is so so good. First I have the, here this Wet n Wild Megalas lipstick in Spotlight Red. This is a very nice blue toned red color and you can see it is a true red color. It gives you a semi matte finish. It's not like true true matte but it is a semi matte finish. It lasts on me for about 5 hours. And after that it starts fading but it leaves a very nice stain behind which I absolutely love and the formula is really really comfortable it glides on smoothly it does not emphasize any texture on my lips overall I just love this lipstick and the one thing that I do not like about this lipstick is the packaging because the bullet it does not go all the way inside of this tube and whenever I try to like close the cap I always find lipstick everywhere see so I do not like this particular thing I would have liked the packaging if the bullet would have like gone inside of that tube other than that I'm okay with it this is a great lipstick next I have here this Milani color statement matte lipstick in matte confident Again, a very nice maroonish red color. This is a dark red color and perfect for any skin tone. And I love the formula of this lipstick. Look how pigmented it is and this is stunning. This lasts on my lips all day long. I'm not even kidding. It's like a liquid lipstick in a bullet form. I don't know if that makes sense or not. 
but it lasts on on my lips all day long it does transfer when you eat or drink but you know what it is so nicely pigmented even after transferring it leaves a very nice um pigment behind and nobody can tell you that the lipstick is actually wearing off it is so nicely pigmented and i love the packaging of this lipstick the packaging is so stunning love this gold kind of a thing and the formula is again so so good if you haven't tried this lipstick yet you have to try it it is so nice and i'm sure you're gonna love this lipstick so yeah give it a shot and the next uh, lipstick that I have in my collection and the first liquid lipstick that I'm going to mention is this NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream and this is in the shade Monte Carlo. This is such a stunning blue toned red color and it is uh, again suitable for any skin tone. And the formula is not drying at all. It is so comfortable, glides on smoothly. The pigmentation is really really good and it takes about 2 minutes to get completely uh, dry and matte though it is not drying at all it does transfer a bit it is not that crazy but yes if you eat or drink it does transfer a bit and it lasts on my lips about seven to eight hours and after that it starts fading but it fades in a very nice way it is not at all a bad kind of fading and yeah and one more thing i love about this lipstick is even if I try to layer it up, it layers up pretty nicely. It does not crumble up or anything like that. So yeah, I highly recommend you this lipstick. The next lipstick that I have here is this Rimmel Stay Satin Liquid Lipstick in the shade Radical. And this is again a nice rich red color, which I absolutely love. And the pigmentation is so good. I have so many things to say about this lipstick because the formula is so surprising to me. When you first apply it, it appears to be a bit glossy, but after like 2-3 to three minutes, it settles down to be a satin matte finish, which I absolutely agree. One more thing, you need a lip liner with this lipstick, other than that, it may bleed on the uh, sides a bit. It's not that crazy, but it may bleed and it transfers a lot. Whenever you eat, you drink, it transfers, but you know what? It is so richly pigmented that even if they're transferring a lot, it lasts on your lips for a good amount of time. Like the day when I was tasting out this lipstick and it was um, like transferring a lot and I was like, oh my god, my money got wasted because it's not gonna last for a good amount of time. But I was surprised. After like 6 hours when I looked at the mirror, I was so surprised because even after like transferring so so much, the pigmentation was spot on. Like nobody could tell that I, I had been wearing this lipstick for like 6 hours. I am going to attach a picture so that you can see what it was looking like after 6 hours and transferring crazily look at that this is such a nice formula if you are looking for a good comfortable red lipstick give it a shot i love the formula of this lipstick this is so so good Ugh. doing lip swatches is the hardest thing in the world and my foundation is like fading I have here this Wet n Wild Cat Suit uh, Liquid Lipstick in the shade Missy and Fierce and you guys have probably seen me using this lipstick so many times and I have raved about this lipstick on my channel. The formula of these lipsticks is so good. This is a complete matte finish lipstick and it takes about one minute to get completely matte and once it is dry, it is 100% transfer proof. I mean, look. See, there is absolutely zero transfer whatsoever. I love the formula of this lipstick. It does not uh, transfer, does not fade and it lasts on my lips about 8 to 9 hours and after that it starts fading a bit from the center. But you know what, after like 8 to 9 hours, I do not really mind that. I love the pigmentation and it is so comfortable, it's not drying on my lips at all. I love the formula of this lipstick so so much. 
I will say it is a cool toned red lipstick and the color is quite uh, different from the rest. It is a cool toned red lipstick and again suitable for any skin tone. Love the lipstick. Next I have here this Milani Amor Matte Lipstick in the shade Devotion. A stunning gorgeous dark red color and I love it. Please excuse the blotchy application because you know what I have been swatching so many lipsticks and it's not possible to do that perfect lip swatch. I really love these lipsticks. It's not like overly drying, a bit drying but if you know what if you exfoliate your lips and if you uh, apply a lip balm underneath you are good to go and it lasts all day long no matter what you eat what you drink it does not transfer even like 0.1 percent you know it does not transfer at all i love the shade i love the formula and it is a super duper matte lipstick i love this lipstick this is my all-time favorite lipstick formula this is my all-time favorite red lipstick next i have here this slick matte me lipstick in the shade Rioja red this is a very vibe Brand red color orangish red color and this is probably the brightest red out of the bunch this is so comfortable lasts about seven to eight hours it does not transfer and if you layer it up for like two times you get a nice opacity which I absolutely love it takes about 30 to 40 seconds to settle down to be a completely dry matte finish and one thing I have noticed about this lipstick is that after it is dry you cannot really um, layer it up and if you do so it starts to become a bit crumbly so you have to be really really quick in terms of layering up if you are not that quick then I think you are not gonna like this lipstick love the formula of this lipstick this is not streaky this is not overly drying this is completely matte and transfer proof like see there is absolutely zero transfer whatsoever the formula is really really good it's matte but not drying at all it is so lightweight and comfortable you cannot even feel that you are wearing a lipstick on your lips it does not transfer it lasts about seven to eight hours on my lips even after eating and drinking i love the formula of this lipstick so so much I think uh, this shade is perfect for lighter to medium skin tone but on deeper skin tone it will appear to be kind of orangish bright color which according to me will not look that flattering but if you are uh, lighter to medium skin tone definitely go for it love 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 this lipstick next I have here this L'Oreal infallible pro matte liquid lipstick in the shade Mediter. again a gorgeous blue toned red color and it looks absolutely stunning on any skin tone it glides on smoothly and it stays all day long it is so comfortable it's not drying at all and this color is suitable for any skin tone no matter what skin tone you are deep dark medium brown olive fair you will rock this shade I love the formula of this lipstick this is so big so pigmented and this is so comfortable it's not drying at all it lasts all day long on my lips and it is absolutely transfer proof though it is very comfortable very creamy if I do like this like pressing my lips together I can feel a tacky kind of a thing but it is 100% transfer proof like see there is absolutely zero transfer and it lasts all day long i love the formula of these lipsticks yeah this is again a great lipstick next i have here this maybelline uh, superstay matting lipstick in the shade pioneer again a gorgeous red color and this red uh, shade is suitable for any skin tone love the formula of these lipsticks the formula is so comfortable it's not drying it's not streaky it's not patchy at all and it lasts on my lips all day long Does transfer a bit not like too much but just a bit and it is such a color that makes you look fair instantly it lasts on my lips 
all day long no matter what i drink no matter what i eat it lasts like all day long the formula is so amazing removing this from your lips can be a bit problematic you need a nice makeup remover to remove it from your lips i sometimes use olive oil or coconut oil to remove it from my lips or i uh, sometimes use this physician's formula um makeup removing balm to remove it completely from my lips and i feel like uh, the formula of this lipstick and the l'oreal one the formula is quite similar only the l'oreal one is a bit more tacky than the maybelline one that is the only difference other than that i feel like the formula is quite similar so again the formula is good the staying power is good price point is amazing color is amazing so yeah i highly recommend you this lipstick last but not least i have here this color pop ultra matte uh, lipstick in the shade uh, creeper this is stunning red color the formula of uh, color pop lipsticks is a bit drying so you have to be really careful but i don't mind that because if i apply a thick lip balm i'm good to go I love the formula of this lipstick. This stays on my lips all day long. It is absolutely transfer proof and it takes about 30 seconds to get dry and after it is dry it is 100% transfer proof. It is not streaky, it is not patchy, it is so comfortable and so lightweight you cannot even feel that you are wearing a lipstick. No matter what I drink, what I eat, it lasts on me all day long. Love the formula of these lipsticks. This is my all-time favorite red lipstick. So those were my all-time favorite top 10 red lipsticks. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you found this video helpful. If you did, then please hit the like button and please subscribe to my channel. So yeah, see you soon in my next one. Till then, bye and take care. Mwah.